Ow, now, brown cow. Ow, now, brown cow. <laughs> What's up? My name is McKinsey and this is episode 8 of my daily design series. So in today's design, I played around with a uh, video player concept. So my goals were to make a modern sleek looking video player, but allow the user to see information about the video, for example, the title, description, and rating of the video itself uh, before they play the video and if they paused. So I know you are excited to see this design. I'm excited to show you. So let's jump in. Whenever I can, I always try to make custom icons. That way I have full control over exactly how they look uh, because it, a lot of times it's in the smallest of details that make or break the design. So instead of just a standard play button, I wanted a button that visually just begged you to push play. So I used a little ripple effect on the button, kept it flat still, and then I used the highlight color of pink as a subtle drop shadow to add just a bit more emphasis on the play button.
So this is one of the most important elements on this design. It gives the user context into what they're about to watch and what other users thought of it. So when going about this, I wanted to make this an important element visually, but yet keep it subtle and not have it overpower the video player itself. All right guys, that wraps up episode eight. I would love to hear what you guys think of this design. And of course, I would love to see what your take on a modern video player is. So when you're designing this today, I want you to uh, try to incorporate the title, description, and ratings uh, in a subtle way that doesn't overpower the video player itself. So if you create a design, be sure to add a link in the comments below. I would love to check it out. And of course, as always, be sure to check right back here tomorrow for another design. See you guys later.